Hello beautiful people, how's it going? I'm back with another video. Today we're going to be watching The Mandalorian Episode 3, which is called The Sin, and I'm very excited. As you guys know, I've reacted to everything that I've never seen before on this channel, so if you guys are new, hello! I've reacted to every single Star Wars movie that has ever been released. And right now, at this point, I also have the very first Lord of the Rings video up, because um, I've never seen Lord of the Rings. And if you guys are into that kind of stuff, you should subscribe! Because why not? And to those of you who are not subscribed, hello beautiful people, welcome back. I'm really grateful for all of you guys, for your constant support. You guys are really the reason I do this and it means the whole world that you guys are constantly coming back for more videos and it just really, really makes me happy and has a special place in my heart. So thank you guys so much. If you haven't already and you want to, you can follow me on Instagram and Twitter. The links are in the description box below so you can constantly get updated on when I make new videos or if you just want to hear about my day-to-day -day life, you guys can do that. In terms of The Mandalorian, I'm really, really digging the show right now. Of course, the child is my favorite aspect of the show, so I'm interested to see what they do with his character. Um, and I also think the dynamic between the child and The Mandalorian is what makes it so great. Obviously, um, the budget of the show is absolutely huge. The music and the cinematography for a Disney show, like a streaming show, is something that I've only seen and can compare to with Game of Thrones, which is one of my favorite shows of all time. Um, and so it's really interesting and I'm very excited to see how the story progresses. We're on episode three and we're binging. And so I'm very excited to just get this all done and dusted. And so without further ado, this is my reaction to The Mandalorian Episode 3. I'm just always amazed by the intro. It still gets to me. <laughs> oh wow, look at him. He's adorable, man. Like, I completely get why he stole the show. <laughs> He's not gonna do it, there's no way. Honestly, if I were him, I would have kept the, like, the cage, like, closed, because... He's just discovering the world, and he's adorable, and he deserves the world. I can't believe he's actually taking the child to him. It's just not a good idea. That's disgusting. It's not worth it. It's just really not worth it. My God. No. Unfortunately, finding a Mandalorian these trying times. I genuinely cannot believe he just did that. I'm very disappointed in you, Mando. I'm very disappointed. It's just upsetting. It's not even worth it. What's the point in this? The Empire is no longer as it ever been a Never. Are we ever gonna see what he looks like without his helmet on? I mean, it's Ober and Martell. I'm sure the public would love to see him. Did not know it was my enemy. Because it's not it's harmless. Oh my god. This is the way. This is the way. This is the way. This is the way. I'm never going to get over the budget of the show. Mm -hmm. 
Honestly, this just reminds me of Jin's story from Rogue One. Like, quite literally reminds me of Jin's story. Like, even, like, when they, like, take her down there and everything. Is he? I don't know. He kind of let go of the child. I'm bitter. I'm really bitter. Oh, see, he wants to forget about the child. But it's not going to work. I know it's not going to work. Because... Who can forget that face? <laughs> the Empire is gone, Mando. Yeah, no it's not. We know it's not. Is he really leaving? They're probably gonna tear the child apart. And he's leaving. Yeah, feel guilty. Feel it in your chest. Unreal. Bro. Yes. Yes. Save the child. Please save the child. <laughs> nice. That's excellent. I prefer that behavior. Mando can fight. <laughs> nice. Whoa. That new technology is very impressive. Why does he even care? You put the bounty down and perhaps I'll let you pass. Why does he even care? Because I'm your only hope. No, the Mando's only hope is himself, but okay. He was a bland character from the beginning, so if he dies, I really couldn't care less. He has a flamethrower in his arm. Oh, he's going to call the child for help. I love that strategy. I love this team. I love this family. Yeah. Oh, wow. The Mandos are saving him. The other Mandalorians are saving him. This is the way. This is the way. <laughs> I finally get the memes now. Oh my god. You know those people who are just really irritating and just never leave you alone? Yeah, that's him. Ooh. <laughs> it was really that easy. Oh my days. Of course he's alive. Because we didn't need any more problems. Money really can get you everything, huh? Oh wow, they can fly. <laughs> 
Oh, that's amazing. That's amazing continuity. I love it. I love it. What a nice, happy ending. I love the way this... Yeah, yeah. I love the way this is going. I'm gonna be completely honest with you guys. While I love this episode, I'm realizing that these episodes are really short. Now, I know the budget was a lot to film these episodes, but it's like... Like, this episode is supposedly 40 minutes long, but I swear it's like 7 minutes of credits. Why? I mean, I got really excited to watch, like, a longer episode, and then when it ended, I was like, wow, really? Like, that was it? Um, but then again, this was... I think this was the best episode of the series so far. Again, this is only episode 3, but we're on a binge streak, so we're binging them all right now. But I did really like it. I really like the dynamic between the child and Mando. But I will say, the show is definitely the best when Mando and the child are together. When they're separated, like when the Mandalorian sold him, which I was very not happy about, as you guys could tell. Um, it's not that it was weaker, but it turned into a different genre. I mean, it went back to the Mando being, you know, um, a, a heist man, which is completely fine. Uh, because that's what Mandalorians are. But again, I think the strength of the show is the relationship between the child and the Mandalorian. And so I want to see more of that. We have, what is it, six or five, five episodes left. I want to see more of the child and Mando. Uh, I think that is what I want to see the most. I did really like the episode, though. It's really interesting to see Yoda who's not Yoda. And it's very interesting to see Yoda, but like as a baby, it's it's just entertaining. Like all I can say is that it's very entertaining. So that's really great. Um, and I did also want to say a big thank you to all of you beautiful people who have just joined. My Lord of the Rings videos have been doing so well. And I'm very appreciative to every single one of you who has come and subscribed and just been great. It's amazing. Genuinely, when I started this channel, I had no idea that it would turn into what it is today. I had no idea that I would get like, what, 22, 23,000 subscribers. I had no idea that, that like over 10K people would watch no matter what video I'd upload. It's unbelievable. And you guys are so supportive. And I really, really want to say thank you to all of you beautiful people for really just supporting me and showing me constant love. It means the whole world. And the fact that you guys watch my videos is what allows me to make more and allows me to do what I love. And especially in times like these dark, 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 dark times, um, we need a little bit of light. And I'm so appreciative that you guys chose me. I know I say this in almost every video, but it's because you guys deserve the recognition and you deserve all of the love that I can possibly give to you for being so great and so supportive. You guys mean the whole entire world to me. So thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye guys.